in charge. It's fucking true. I'd like to hear you tell Gerald that it's a boring story. My brother wouldn't take too kindly to that now, would he? You know that Purgatory is called what it is because people were so scared of the McCreary's? Did you know that, Nico? It's called that because people found the McCreary story so fucking boring. Listening to them was like being in Purgatory. Fuck you, Gordon. I'll fucking come back there and kick your fucking ass in a minute. I hear that Francis McCreary is your brother. Fucking Frankie, my brother. He may have a badge, but I tell you for a fact, he's as crooked as the rest of us McCreary's. More so. At least we ain't fucking hypocrites. Kate's the only decent one. I can believe that. You know Frankie, do you? I got a story for you if you do. Another fucking story. Shut up, Gordon. So, Nico. When Francis and Gerald was growing up, Frankie becomes an altar boy. He swears to this day that he wanted to serve the Lord. Jerry knows the truth, though. He only put on that cassock so he could pocket the change in the collection plate. Fact. That's Francis, down to a fucking T. I don't even... ...realizes what a crook he is. That sounds like the Francis McGreary I met. I bet. Model community leader, my ass. You're just worried he'll start clamping down on you, ain't you, Paggy? I'd like to see him try it. Not gonna happen with the things Jerry knows. Fucking truth. All right, boys. If Ray is correct, then the money's going to be kept in the office in the main building. And there should be a boat docked out back for the getaway. All right, it's up and over the fence. Nico, stick fucking close to me. Cover me, will you?
Nico, what the fuck? Okay, kids, I got the cash. Can you get us a car, man? I'm afraid these two idiots can't drive for shit. Fuck you, Packy. Yeah, fuck you. Algonquin Bridge on Colony Island, big man. Becky, you hang out at some strange place. First you take me to a fish market and now a waste plant? It looks like he ain't too pleased with the date you've been taking him on, Patrick. You gotta learn how to treat a man right. Shut it, Gordo. Ray's giving us a tip-off about a big payment the Ancelotti's just got. We're all gonna do real well out of this. These places are messed up. 
I think this Ray guy's fucking with you. No one's fucking with me, Nico. This is how things work here. The whole city's turned into a fucking theme park. Only places an honest criminal can make any money are these shitholes. I think they're fucking with you, Packy. They're laughing at you. You think they're having a laugh with Gerald Gordo? You think even these alderney Guidos would have the balls to do that? Them Guidos use you for what they like. If the peg ass Gerald to wipe his ass, he probably would. What's that say about you then, Gordo, if you're taking orders from Packy? That don't mean shit. Fucking with us or not, these jobs pay the bills, don't they? The only thing they're doing for Gordon is keeping the bookies off his back for another week. How much you lose on that swingers game last week? That that shit was rigged. I got screwed in the ninth damn inning. A guy who bats 150, it's a three-run homer. Bullshit. Don't go dropping too much green after this. If the Ancelotti's here, we've been spending it up. They might finger us for this job. Happens the bookies will be the least of your words. Don't trouble yourself about me, Packy. I'm sitting on my money. I'm gonna throw it all the bookies like Gordon over here. I'm saving it up, so. I don't give a shit what you're doing with your cut. All I care about is you holding up your end on the job. Shouldn't save too much, Michael. You never know. You might get hit by a bus tomorrow. Ah, not St. Michael here. My cousin, Roman, he has this gambling problem as well. Can't have a dollar in his pocket without spending it in the card game. Are these his dollars he's spending or yours? What's mine is his. We are cousins. I like it. Here we are, boys. Moment of fucking truth. All right, boys. If Ray is correct, then the money's going to be kept in the office in the main building. And there should be a boat docked out back for the getaway. All right, it's up and over the fence. Don't go too fucking far, Nico. Let's go inside and find this money. 